we are going to learn how to install and format Prettier code extension for VS Code so that we can take our messy code that looks like this, hit save, and then it auto formats for us. If I go back, we see that the empty spaces are being removed, the missing semicolons after each line is being added, and the single quotes are being changed into double quotes, which I have specified to use in my project. Let's install Prettier by going to the extensions tab, searching for Prettier. It should normally be the first one that pops up. We see the blue check mark here, and we also see that it has 37 million installs. We click install. So it might work as intended for you by default. So if we go back to our script here, if we add some empty spaces here, remove the semicolons and change this to single quotes, hit save. It might do that automatically. If something doesn't work for you, we're gonna go down here in the left corner. We're gonna click manage, go to settings, and this is opening our VS Code settings. Here, notice that we are on the user settings. We're gonna search here in the settings for default formatter. And here we can see I already have prettier code formatter selected, but you might have to scroll down here and select it. So select prettier, and then you also have settings here for enabling or disabling prettier for different file types. Back to the settings, then you're going to click on text editor, we're going to go to formatting, and we are going to check this format on save if it is not checked. That's going to make prettier format your code on each save. Then we're going to search prettier and we get into our extensions. We see that we have prettier here. We can click it. And here you have different settings for prettier that you can specify as you want. For example, we can enable or disable prettier here. Scrolling down, we can choose whether to add a semicolon at the end of every line. If we check this one here, we're going to use single quotes instead of double quotes. Let's go back to our script and test that. Currently double hitting save, and now it's single. Let me know in the comments if you have any issue. If you like this video, then there's another one here suggested for you. Until next time, see ya.